Episode 19, Dog Gone. Data entry for log of flying house. Professor Humphrey Mumble tries once again to return to 20th century and once again without success. Chronometer shows we are still at time when Jesus walked the earth. Oh, well, Israel at this time is a good place to be. But, Professor Bumble, when are you going to get us back home? You kids got to have patience. Remember, a journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. Master, we have not landed in Israel. Impossible. Let's get a close-up of the radar map. Oh, I see. Our position does seem to have changed. Seems we're north of Israel. Then we must be in the area of Phoenicia, near the city of Tyre. Prof, you bumbled. Yep, you're right. But look at it this way. Now you have a chance to visit Phoenicia. As an excuse, that really doesn't wash. But shall we explore? Mm-hmm. It's all very pretty and peaceful around here, but without Jesus, it seems rather boring. I know how you feel, Justin, but we've had more experiences with Jesus than most. Most kids don't travel back in time in a flying house built by a bumbling professor. What's that? It's a puppy! Terrific! <laughs> hey, you want to be high? Stay down! Oh, why? What if it's a candy? Here! Chippy, stop begging! It's all right! <laughs> I guess his puppy's name is Chippy. That's right. You like him? Can we play? He's like my puppy back home. It's up to him. Hooray! Come on, Chippy! Ha! Can't catch me! Disappeared. They disappeared into the sunset. Isn't it beautiful? Oh, I've got to go home now. We don't even know your name. It's Nina, and I thank you very much for playing with us. Come on, Chippy. Wanna? Uh huh. Wait, Nina. My mother doesn't know I'm keeping Chippy in the shed. 
All right, come on, Chippy. Now you gotta be a good dog, you hear? He's so cute. Nina! Oh, hello, Mother. Do you want me? Oh, still keeping that good-for-nothing pup, I see. But it's not good for nothing. How many times must I tell you we cannot afford to keep a dog? We don't have enough food for ourselves. But I'll share my food with the dog, please. That is out of the question. Get rid of it! <laughs> mud and tie it in the woods and do it now. You're mean, plain mean. <laughs> huh? Oh. Wait, Nina. <laughs> Chippy, sorry, but I've got to do this. I love you very much, Chippy, but I have to obey my mother. Goodbye. keep looking for in this rain? This rain is miserable. I think we ought to keep going, but the question is, which way? Ah! <gasps> Wasn't that Nina? You're right. Come on. Nina! 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 Justin, look! Oh, <gasps> Tell me, how is she? There's nothing physically wrong with her. She just can't walk. Won't she recover? Nora, I'm sorry, but it seems like a demon. <gasps> oh. Ah! A demon? But that's impossible. She's my baby. Doctor, you've got to cure her. Oh, cure her. Nora, I know how hard it's been for you since your husband died. And now this, I'm sorry. Oh, Nina. Oh. <laughs> Nina, I'm sure you're going to be all right in a little while. I'll do everything possible to make you happy and well again. So cheer up. <laughs> Nina. Oh. Nina, listen to your mother. She's doing all she can to make you well. I want to see Chippy. He's the only one that loves me. Justin's searching everywhere for Chippy. He'll get him. Poor little fellow all alone. Probably soaking wet. I think I'll... Oh. 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 Nina! Mustn't move. <laughs> Nora, so quiet. Justin will be back soon. There he is. Well? Mm -mm. Oh, everything that's happened has been my fault. If I hadn't sent that puppy away, she would never have. I'm sure she'll be all right. Certainly wasn't your fault. It really was my fault. I'm afraid I've neglected my daughter. Since her father died, I've been so concerned with making a living. I forgot about love. <laughs> she really needed that puppy. 
My daughter must walk again, whatever the expense. Jeez. That's it. Jesus could make her well. Terrific. Right, but finding him's a problem. Hmm. <gasps> Jesus, I've heard that he has performed many miracles. What's more, I've heard he's around here somewhere. Yeah. In Phoenicia? Perfect. Oh, it's no use asking him. Why not? They say he's the Messiah for the Jews. Nina and I are Phoenicians, despise Gentiles. I'm sure he won't help her. Jesus isn't that kind of a man. But he's a Jew, and all his help goes only to them. I don't know about that. I do know he'll help anyone who really needs him. Oh, yes. He could really help Nina. I'm sure he could. Want us to find Jesus and ask him? Hmm? Think he would? It's yeah. your best choice. Why not try it? Thank you. I will try. I'll go to him and ask him to heal Nina. I'm sure he'll do it. Just speak right up. He appreciates honesty. Thank you. But what about the care of my Nina? We'll see that she gets everything she could possibly need. But would it be too much trouble for you? Not to worry. Count on me. <laughs> huh? Ha! You're too much. But happily, I know I can count on all of you to help me. Right? Absolutely. For sure. What do you think, Angie? Think Nora will be able to find Jesus? Well, we've only heard that he's somewhere around here. But if he is, I don't think she'll stop until she finds him. Yeah, and I hope it's soon. Actually, I think your mother loves you very much. Hmm. And she didn't understand how much a puppy meant to you. However, more than anything else in the world, she wants you to be happy and well. No, I don't believe that. What do you mean? If she loved me, she wouldn't have left me alone so often. I had no one to play with. Mother was always busy taking care of the goats or whatever. Too busy to play with me. <laughs> Other kids had a father to play with them. But I didn't have a father anymore. Everywhere I went, it was the same. Other people had people to be with, but I was all alone. <laughs> oh, a puppy! You like me! <laughs> you see, Chippy was alone like me without anyone to play with, but then my mother said I couldn't keep him. I know how you feel, but maybe your mother was worried that the dog was too expensive to feed. Besides, I think your mother's worked very hard to provide for you, because she loves you. No, if she really did love me, she'd have let me keep my little puppy. <laughs> I'll go out and look for Chippy again. <gasps> you will? For sure. I want to come along. All right, if Angie will stay here with Nina. Of course. Bye. Oh, Jesus. Jesus, where are you? Remember me? Puppy! There he is. So, there you are. 
We wondered why you ran away. One minute you were with us, and the next you were gone. Is that your little doggy? Ah, uh, yes. A very clever dog. It must have recognized your footsteps. Or else it just sensed your presence, for it suddenly jumped up and ran. Oh, he's been with you? Ever since we found him wandering in the woods, soaked to the skin from the rain. Oh, Chippy, you have saved my life in spite of what I did. <laughs> Nina's right, you are a dear. I must say, you look rather pale. Are you sure you're feeling all right, madam? If there's anything wrong, perhaps we could help. We're disciples of the Master Jesus. What? Jesus' disciples? You must take me to meet Jesus, please. It's very important that I see him. Please, I beg you. Are you Jewish? No, I'm a Phoenician, but I desperately need his help. Hmm, well... And I'm wondering whether Nora was able to see Jesus. Look down there. Isn't that Chippy? And he's with Nora. Hey, Nora! Nora, Chippy! What is it? Oh, the boys. Yay! Oh, Chippy, we've been looking for you everywhere. <laughs> Did you get to see Jesus? How come? Because I'm a Phoenician, a meeting with Jesus cannot be arranged. That's hard to believe. His own disciples told me that. I think you should go right to Jesus and ask him to whack me. Corky, there's times you get great ideas. But I wouldn't know where to find him. <laughs> Chippy must know where he is. Show us where he is, Chippy. Come on, North. I want to find Jesus. Oh, yes. Hmm? I wonder who could be knocking at this hour. Yes? <gasps> that woman's come here. Justin, Corky, what's the meaning of this? Jesus, it's very important. Oh, Jesus, please, please help my little daughter. The doctor says she may have a demon. You've got to help her. Somebody told her that you'd refuse to help her because she's a Phoenician woman. It was I. Master, I tried to explain the reason behind the rule. And I told her it was out of the question. I beg you, sir. It's not for me. It's for my little girl. Madam, you must understand. Jesus was not sent to serve the Gentiles, but only to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. But there's no one else. Please have mercy on me, O oh Lord, son of David. Madam, I must ask you to stop your begging and leave. Leave me alone. Oh. All right, so I'm not Jewish. Will you please tell me why it is you won't help a poor Gentile? Because it is not fair to take the children's bread and throw it to the dogs. Perhaps this puppy shows something for all of us. You say it is not fair to take the children's bread and throw it to the dogs. But I say, yes, Lord, but even the dogs eat crumbs that fall from their master's table. Great is your faith. Be it done for you, woman, even as you desire that it be done. Then, you mean that my daughter Nina will... The demon is now departed from your daughter. Oh. Oh. And you do it for a Phoenician? Mm. Yes. Hey! Terrific! Hooray! Hooray! <laughs> Way to go, Jesus! And you got it as here! Thanks, Chip! Thank you, Jesus. Did she come dashing out of the house if you call her? Yes, but what if she's really... Not healed? Come on, I know you really believe in Jesus' miracles. Yes, of course. Then go ahead, call her. Oh, uh, Nina? I'm home. Nina? Nina? Nina, my 
dearest. She's really walking. Huh? Oh, my legs. Mira, you're all right. Oh, Mother. Oh, 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 oh Nina, Nina. Oh, Nina, please forgive me. Mm -mm. Forgive me. I was so selfish. Darling. Everything's fine. It's hard for children to understand their parents and vice versa. Well, Justin, I seem to remember that you got plenty of scolding from your mother back in the 20th century. But I was always right. <laughs> of course. Isn't it nice that Jesus decided to help and it all worked out? I'm hungry. Hey there! It's a professor. What are you two doing up there, huh? Making it work, right? Everything is perfect. We could all be on our way home if we didn't have to wait for some people. You wanted crumbs from heaven? Sorry, we're out of crumbs. Try this! Ah! Ah! 